Hello, everyone, and welcome back for a brand new and improved video. I'm walking backwards. Can I see? No. I'm cleaning my room at the moment. Can you see my mirror? <laughs> yeah, so, so far my room's pretty good with the cleaning aspect of things. But I don't want to let you see anything. <laughs> But you might see stuff accidentally. <gasps> no, don't look over here. No, don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's face this camera around here. Okay. Yeah. Right. Sorry. Let's face the camera around. And I'm gonna try and record something for you guys today. Guys, hey guys, right, there's this game I really like, and let's go into files, this awesome little game that I love to play, I'm gonna have to hold my non-branded iPad I mean recording device while I do this it's called um, uh, I think it's this one now I actually need to find the executable file this is difficult for me to do because I'm actually Looking through the camera part. <laughs> uh, I'll be right back, guys. <laughs> Once I actually found the game again. Okay, welcome back, guys. I've now um, angled the camera. Hello. Did you see me there? I don't know in a way that you'll hopefully be able to still hear me properly and I've found the file okay why is it running so slow God dang it. Hello? Is this the game that I'm looking for? See if you get that reference. <laughs> You're in for a good amount of points. <laughs> Kimber points. Let's start you off small because you're newcomers, right? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, there you go. Yeah, it, I think it's starting now. That's good. It's starting. So this is based off of the game Scott Corton made. Uh, sister location. Now, after the awesome looking um, cutscene are some things that are also actually quite awesome that I'll show you. It is kind of an awesome cutscene, but it's there's not really much to see. The camera's just floating around the blueprints all the time. I'm and now I'm actually sure I'm sure you've actually seen quite a few people play this demo. Five Nights at Freddy's, Unreal Engine, Sister Location. Now, before I do anything, as we're getting to this screen. <coughs> this screen here let me ask you what does it look like to you I mean it looks like a really awesome cut screen a cut scene right with all these awesome animatronics dancing around and everything let me adjust it for you so so that you can because it's not properly adjusted just yet wait one second I'll have to opt out of it quickly 
and then damn it it's not working because it's not properly adjusted to the screen dang it that nab it if I can't have that if the screen turns off every now and then why is that happening I don't know why sorry about that yeah um God dang Nabit, man. Yeah. Um, but to me, it looks like all the animatronics are in different places in the scenes, sort of thing. When actually, if I press a, f a few buttons, you know the button on your right hand side next to enter, backspace, and right hand shift, you've got this button which looks like an A sign, like an at sign, and a little dash button press the bat that button and then you'll find all these little things pop up these little you've got the time you've been playing for the demo you're for debug actor none I don't know what that means tap apostrophe to close that's the button that I press to open it and use the number pad to toggle categories I don't even know what that stuff means control plus title this is actually the first time I've been able to read all this stuff. Spectate tab mode. Tab the b press button. Press the tab button for spectator mode. Q to navigate. Is that O? I think that's O to navigate. Ma navigate mesh. One all behavior tree. Behavior tree. That sounds cool. That's button number two. Okay. Well, I'm now gonna press spectator mode which is a tab and when I do that the whole screen is now frozen well uh, kind of frozen in a way that um, that um, you can only see this one animatronic and I want to stop it here so that I can show you something I'm now in quote unquote uh, no clip mode on this screen now it's very clever now before I did this I actually thought every one of these animatronics was in a state of this animatronic is in this area see that so she's in this part of this screen and then you've got all the other animatronics on different screens but they're actually surprise surprise ta-da all the animatronics you saw there are all still here actually you got that one Ballora's minion Ballora herself baby herself creepy as hell and then Freddy you see they're all here isn't that clever the first time I can't quite tell you the first time I saw these animatronics like this I actually thought this is so clever they're all here in this part sort of thing of this area I, I didn't actually think that they were like this it's so clever how they've done this focus damn it there you go now you can see all the words I was talking about ah never mind yeah so that's really clever now if I press enter, if I press apostrophe again to take spectator mode away, it will go back to where it was before. Just clipping through all of the animatronics like that. Very clever, right? Are you still filming? <laughs> Are you guys still seeing this? Good, okay it is. I don't know how much memory I have left. But then we're going to be, after this clip here, which is black for some reason. We're going to be in the area um, where we're in the lift. Uh, this game has been made by someone called Angus. Is it Angus Games or Angus? I think this this demo is free to play until Angus is out with the actual the actual fan game, the full version of the fan game. 
you would not believe how much stress I went through actually trying to make this game completely work properly because it was glitching everywhere it crashed and everything but now I've actually got it working isn't that lovely now handbots talking to me about stuff that's in the game but if we just press apostrophe again to skip all this and then go into um, spectator mode with tab you're going to see me slip right out of that elevator now I'll go down myself to the bottom really quickly for you there you go we didn't actually have very far to go in the lift but never mind <laughs> but hey doesn't matter and now we can go into places we haven't actually been able to go through before because I've just gone into quote unquote um, spectator mode which is like kind of in a way it's like no clip mode quote unquote no clip mode whoops I went into the ground too far now here we are in the primary control room yeah I read it off the box you're right guys I didn't actually know this the what this place is called but look at that that is so cool golden freddy fun time edition that's so weird that's so crazy why is it filming in such bad quality you want it to stay in good quality but it's not doing that it keeps on trying to um i think it's any time i bump the table or bump the boxes that i've actually been mounted onto which is great really great and we got funshine foxy in that room party time now this means we can go to baby's room hey baby wakey wakey baby hello are you there I think I see you if I get out of spectator mode it won't drop me back here like if you think no clip mode does that's normally what no clip mode does but this doesn't do that when I press tab again I'll get back in the lift so let's get back to work shall we we do we do I fall through here and I'll show you a few other things they've actually this is actually quite clever they've actually put jump scares in this game even though it's a de it's the demo version of the game isn't that kind of weird do be do do be do be do be do be wish I could go faster that would be fun wouldn't it but I don't think they've implemented running yet now in the primary control room blah de blah de blah I wish hand unit would hurry up I'm sorry I can't put it any louder otherwise I'd be waking people up <sighs> yada 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 let's turn on the light and see go on in Oh no, Valora is not there. She must be taking the day off. Let's motivate her with a controlled shock. That might put the spring back in her step. Bizarre! I'm so sorry, Dancy Pants. There you go. Excellent. Back to her old self again, yada yada yada. This is a fun time auditorium, blah de blah de blah, where Ballora is again, because <laughs> Ballora is in two places at once, according to me, apparently. Oh no. Not today. Looks like fun time Foxy's taking a day off. With well, a control shock. <laughs> Zap. 
Oh dear. How about we try another controlled shock? Bizarre. You can even jump in this this game this game too. And then Hooray! Well time Foxy is in perfect working order. Let's go down and see baby. That did sound kind of wrong, go down, but I mean, technically, that's what we're doing. <laughs> we're down on our knees, so, I mean, what else is there to say, right? Let me check, are you still filming? Yes, you are. You know, now that we can go into spectator mode, or quote-unquote, um, uh, the thing, the thing mode, we can go in to see Golden Fun Time Freddy. In this room here, where it's all access denied, which is quite weird. I mean, it's not weird that it's access denied, but it's weird that I think in the wait a minute, the game's trying to prove me wrong. Dang, nabbit! I don't know, whatever. Going to spectator mode, and we see this room. Now, this room scares me a bit. Look at this guy here. He is so scary. Why is he golden, though? That's the thing that. Or yellow, or whatever. That's the thing that confuses me. Angus, uh, tell me, what are you gonna do with him? Uh, this is so weird. It's so spooky. As I said, there are jump scares, but not with the animatronics that are like this. He does not jump scare you. So some yeah, for some reason there's nothing else in this room. Weird, right? I'm just too scared to get anywhere closer to him. There you go though. Back out of spectator mode and on with our little um, fun time um, tour that's the word I was looking for on. my screen turned off again there you go also I'm sorry if I yelled in your ear RIP headphone users, someone just, someone from the family's gone to work tonight. <laughs> yep, on the other side of the glass. Fun time, baby. Now let's give her a shock. Some of the lights are out, but we'll fix that later. As we all know and love from this game. Oh, control shock. Zap. Oh dear, looks like we need to try another control shock. A bazap. Oh, there she is. We can already see her little eyes. <laughs> Great job, circus baby. We wouldn't like you to get too overwhelmed, but this is the thing that kind of creeps me out a bit in this game right here. As we're walking through here, we see some legs, some mysterious characters' legs. Was that, was that, fun time, salvage Bonnie or spring trap, fun time spring trap? That was weird, right? Who the heck was that, Angus? What are you doing? Tell me about that. That's weird, man. Now, as soon as I cross that threshold on the ground, it's going to cut to the cutscene where there is not one. Isn't that a bit weird? I found that a bit weird. There is a cutscene in this game, which is the death cutscene, mini cutscene, but... There's no cutscene for whatever that is where it goes black. Now, technically, it hasn't gone black yet. I tricked you. 
I, we haven't crossed the threshold like about now. This is where we are in our house before we've got the popcorn and the eggs benedict exotic buttered. We're watching Vlad and Clara have an argument at home. So let's just wait until this passes. Are you still recording? I really hate it when the camera blacks out like that. I'll have to try and fix that or something. Don't worry. I'll do my best. I'll be right back as soon as we get to the part where the lift is on the ground again. Okay, hey guys, I'm back. The game crashed on me earlier, so I gotta restart it. Um, I'm getting back to the part where I've actually upped the volume level a little bit. Hopefully you'll be able to hear it now a little better. Um, and also, I might try doing it in editing and everything. I also want to just say that, you know what, this game is really awesome. Um, I hope it goes very far in the next stage, you know, and last time I played it, a few years ago, I'm really glad that you made one of these, because it's just so awesome. Um... And if I'm going to be playtesting this game, I want to tell you something. Down here in the vents, in the area where you actually walk into the vent and you start going in on night one. Wait, then this is night two, isn't it? I can't remember properly. No, I think this is night. This is night one, I think, yeah right here where you start going through the vent at night one is a bit rubbish but in night two i think you have to go back through the crawl space and it's okay then but when you're going through the crawl space in the first place it's just a little bit glitchy it kind of doesn't let you go through very easily so if you could fix that angus that would be great like not just for me that would help lots of other people play the game as well so that's one little thing you could brush up on. And, and I know this is a demo, so that means you're going to probably fix that later. There's this other thing where if you get jump scared, I've only been jump scared by the little baby, which I'll show you in a minute once this thing kicks back into gear. I also want to tell you something, Angus. Uh, I think that's about it actually um, when I, whenever I think about it again I'm going to I'll tell you but I can't quite think about it right now I think you've really got it really clever really cleverly made and everything you've thought about so many like awesome clever things and um, in the development of this game it's really awesome well done you see I'm not always very good with that's the thing about me and comment commentary I'm not always very good at it when there's only me and Joe isn't around don't worry next week uh, you'll see him again next week actually I, I, I oh god I shouldn't have said that I'll try and edit that bit out but if I can't then never mind sorry spoilers whilst I haven't actually been recording things on or actually uploading or anything with Joe I've been storing them so that I can I'm, I, I've been filming them in bulk so I can possibly edit them but if not edit them straight away just I don't know like just put them out to you like actually publish them out 
for you guys to watch. Let me out. Yeah, so. Yeah. But you'll see him again sometime soon. You're probably wondering what the heck I'm talking about. Get out now or whatever. Stay in here if you want. I'm trying to open it. There you go. There's actually something really clever I saw earlier. Which is if I go back into spectator mode that I was talking to you about earlier. And do this. You can actually see a few things. AI. That says AI controller. One. Bitty bab. Now what's happening up there is spectator mode. I'll show you. <gasps> what the heck is that? That's scaring me. Can you see those eyes? Let me just make it focus again. That's creepy. Those little eyes right in front of me. I don't know who's making those eyes. But I'll try and stay away from it. I mean, unless you want to see a jump scare, do you? I don't know if that one's going to hurt me or anything. Wow, look at those flashing lights, man. Sorry about seizure warning. I should have said that. Wow. Oh my word. This is cool, isn't it? I'm kind of scared of the jump scares, though. Which I should be. I have every right to fear them. Oh, wait, what was that? Oh, it's this guy again. Hello, buddy. You alright? Everything's a bit more lit up now. That's weird. Why is everything a bit more lit up now I can actually see in this room? This is actually something I haven't done yet. Oh my god, holy moly. No jokes. No word of a lie. These room, this room is now lit up and starry chair. It's got starry chairs. They look like they've got bunny ears. Wow. Does that mean he's going to hurt me if I get too close to him? Should I do it, guys? I'm too scared to do it. I don't want to. At the same time, I don't want to. This is really cool, though. Wow. Holy mackerel. Oh my gosh. This is super cool. But very creepy at the same time. I don't know if he will still uh, get me. But yeah. Wait a minute, what was that? Oh, I know what that was, I think. Oh. Guys, I'm scared. Someone's off their stage and I'm very, very scared. Wait, oh, okay. I'm getting very um, turned around. hear like a tapping sound anytime I go in there or like a palp palpitation is that the word so anytime I go into that corner that sound freaks me out but it's very clever right guys how they've made this game I keep on seeing a little green line anytime I come here Anytime I come over here, there's a green line that appears. 
Oh, I'm freaking out. Okay, guys. I take it you really do want to see me do the whole bitty bat thing. So I'm going to go over there. Uh, sorry about that, guys. Wait a minute. Oh, God. Markiplier went to the hospital last night. Oh, great. Have you been drinking again, Mark? That's not healthy. Don't be naughty, Mark. You know what you should do and what you shouldn't do? Dooby 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 dooby. Gotta go and check on Phantom Foxy. Oh no. No, I don't want to go see Baby's auditorium. I'm gonna go in this room. Because I can and I want to get jump scared. But I don't want to get jump scared at the same time. I'll do it. Uh, should I save it for later, guys? I think I should probably save it for later. The anticipation is killing me, though. Now, Angus, I think this is where I crawl through and it kind of glitches. And I can't quite get through it as quick. It stops for a minute at a time. Yeah. Now, I might have sounded a little bit angry whilst explaining that I wasn't very angry. I wasn't tricking you either. It's just because, you know, I'm a bit freaked out and also because, um, uh, that's just the way uh, I talk sometimes when I explain things. Hope you understand. Circus Baby had a very tough night, apparently. Well, we shouldn't. We shouldn't be. Excuse me. A shocking baby. That's not nice. She's just a child. This bit is something that kind of scares me quite a lot. Look at that. I'm sorry about the bad quality. I tried making it a little better, but it didn't really work very well. That's creepy as heck, right? Look at those eyes again. Okay, guys. I'm going to walk into this. If I, if I get scared, it's your fault, okay? I don't know if I should do this or not. I don't know if I should do this. I don't know if I want to do this. I don't know if I want to get too close to this. I don't know what it is, for one thing. I 
I don't know whose eyes this is. Oh, I'm creeped out, guys. I'm scared right now. Okay, I'm rolling my swivel chair slightly away from the screen. And uh, I'm going to let you guys walk into it instead. Ha ha ha! Loopholes. Okay. But you guys look at, watch this while I go away. Okay. I haven't got very far to go in my room. I'll still be with you. Don't worry. Okay, I did it, and it didn't kill me, which is good. But it did scare me quite a lot. Now you want to see... Now you want to see something that can actually kill me? One of these babies in this room can kill me. Either this one or the other one. These bitty babs. I don't know which one can kill me. If it's this one that looks deactivated or if it's the other one that can kill me. Just ignore it when it keeps saying access denied. I'm going to do the thing again where I swivel my chair back and I'm going to go I'm going to walk into this bitty bab it might not work because I'm in spectator mode so let's try it anyway didn't actually happen it didn't actually kill me you guys happy with me I did it I faced a fear of mine but I've got to fear another one I've got to fear another face it's the faces of evil what I don't know what I'm saying I gotta go into this room and actually walk into and not no clip or spectator mode into this little guy right here. This is gonna creep the heck out of me. You ready, you ready guys? Look at that guy. He's actually on the move. That guy's actually walking. And because I've turned on a apostrophe mode, you can actually see where he walks. With the green line telling us where he goes. You see? Oh my god, he almost walked into me and jump scared me. Yeah, this is something weird, Angus. Why do the biddy babs, when they walk towards the player, why don't they not actually make contact and actually jump scare you? You have to walk into it yourself. Shouldn't it be the other way around? It walks into you and jump scares you. I don't know, but look at this, this, this little bitty bab here. That one, when you walk into this one, it doesn't jump scare you. 
But look at that pretty purple or pink dress. So cute. Am I right? Okay, one more time. I'm going to swivel back on my chair and uh, get the death screen for you guys, okay? Here goes, guys. No, actually, I've already been jump scared by the baby, and I know that there isn't really a jump scare thing for it. Baby is actually talking to me right now. I can show you her animation for when she's talking to you. Look what she's doing. <laughs> she looks quite funny, actually. Hello, you creepy little baby face. There's something on her stage or something which looks a bit weird over there. Can you see that? Oh, you can't quite see it anymore. Anytime you go into spectator mode, everything goes dark. See you later, you creepy weirdo. See you later, you creepy baby. Baby face. Now I need to go into Ballora Gallery. Now I haven't actually seen if Ballora actually jump scares you or not. She's gotten pretty close to me some of the time, half the times so I've played the, played the demo. But I don't know. Let's have a look, shall we? We're both in this together, okay? So if I get scared, you will too. Oh god. You see that? I'm trying to get through and it it's kind of getting stuck. Okay, now this is kind of creepy, but now that it's a little bit lit up in this room for some reason it's a little more lit up I can see more Skinner I'm trying to see if I can get into the gap under the table like you can do in the actual game doesn't look like it's happening <gasps> I just saw her oh my god I can do it I'm under the table <gasps> oh I like what you've done Angus you can hide under the table where Ballora is but not where baby is is that what you've actually meant to do purpose purposefully Willingly. <laughs> very clever though, very good. I see what you've done. Now I'm going to get the willy shit uh, scared out of me. Sorry about that rude word I almost said. Look at this. Some awesome little controllers you've got here. <gasps> she got very close to me, but it didn't scare me just then. What's that say? Master engine status. Sorry, it's starting to lag quite a lot in this room for a re some for some reason now. For a re for a reason. <laughs> Okay, you guys. I 
don't like this one bit. I do not even like this. Hello, Ballora. I wonder if she's got purple eyes like in the game. You're on your own, guys. Hey, she escaped me. Target escaped me, officers. Go in for another try. Sorry about that, I didn't mean to swear. What is this? Chase the pigeon or something? Come on, Ballora. Scare me. I dare you. Was that a bad thing to say to Ballora? That you dare her? Ah, uh, sorry about that, guys. It keeps on turning itself off and it has to stop doing that. Well, the screen does anyway, that is. Guys, I don't think it's working. I'm getting very close to her, but she's not. She's still not scaring me. Or well, initiating the jump scare of hers. Where's she gone? Oh, she's over there. Definitely getting me mighty scared. Maybe she's getting scared of me. She's running away from me after all. the technology is actually available to do this Angus do you think you could actually try putting some kind of very clever technology on Ballora so she actually doesn't try to avoid you but tries to lock onto your position so anytime you're making too much noise she can actually get closer to you instead of a, uh, further away from you that would be really clever Ballora Hey, scare me. Scared cat. Now because I'm on the the scale of autism that I am, I sometimes can't tell the time properly. So I might not actually be able to tell how long I've been filming for. So I think I'm probably just going to end it here, guys. She hasn't scared me either. So, I think that's for the best. You know, go away, Ballora. I'm just going to go over to this door to finish the game, okay? And I'll leave you in peace. Where are you? <gasps> well, there you are, Ballora. I'm going to leave you. I'm going to leave you alone. She always avoids me anyway. See ya, guys. See ya, uh, pizzeria. Uh sister location pizzeria I hope to see this game fully fledged in well maybe not so long I guess don't know however long it will take you know you can click um, annotation I haven't got annotations on my screen usually 
what happens though is YouTube is going to if I depending on what I call this video YouTube is going to try and link it to you 